TIAs are some symptoms of potential stroke, uh, numbness and tingling, a sudden dizziness, a, a sudden activity of change. And the key word is sudden, but you don't know at the time if it's a mini stroke or a full-blown stroke in the early processes. There's been a lot of research on people who've had a stroke and then you ask them questions about, did you have these warning signs in the past? And about 23 to 30 percent of the stroke patients have indicated they did previously have those warning signs. And looking at men and women who had been hospitalized with TIA, we looked at their data 30 days and up to a year following their hospitalization, and we found that women had a 30% uh, uh, decreased chance of having a stroke within 30 days of their discharge, significantly um, less than, than men. And even at, uh, up to a year following their hospitalization for a stroke, they still had uh, a decreased risk of having a stroke, and it was a little bit less. It was about a 15% decreased risk of having a stroke. I think this should really help guide us in determining what, what, what are the differences between men and women. What's happening after they're discharged? Are they uh, getting different care? Are they following the you know, doctor's orders differently? Are they um, less likely to be treated uh, in, in the hospital? Um, it's, it's, you know, there's a lot of interesting hypotheses that can come out of this um, that we need to gather some more data to look at.